dear friends from all over the world, it's Anetta. Welcome in Anime's lovely place. And today I have my sweet lovely Angelica with me. Because it's Wednesday and on Wednesdays we wear pink. And that's hosted by our friends Shara from Reborn Living Dolls. And my friends from Montreal, Claudia and Paula, did ask for... Uh, Angelica and for Jeremy so we will pu put Jeremy on the list but today we will show Angelica and Angelica is the Xia sculpt by Adri Stute from the Netherlands and she is painted and rooted by myself and she's very cute she has lovely beautiful um, glass eyes I did also buy them from Adri Stute herself so they are beautiful eyes, really beautiful. Maybe I can show you. You see the see the ring light now, but you see how beautiful those eyes are. And I painted her very slightly. She has a little bit of stork bite, but I don't. I I do, I don't. I think you cannot see it really. So and uh, she's in this lovely sleeper. I love that sleeper. I've bought it for her before when I was painting her. It's a lovely, lovely sleeper. And um, she wanted to say hello to her twin sister over at Jenny's Joy. Hi, honey. That's honey. And we have, we have our Angelica. And she is the um, limited edition. And I don't know what number she is. It is a very low number. Number four from 500 she has. So, yeah. And she was born on, let me see, Angelica, the 13th of September from last year. So she's a few months old now. And I want to change her. Uh, I uh, tried this, this, this um, lovely cute sweater yesterday on one of my bigger curls but the arms are very short so I thought well that will be nice for my sweet lovely Angelica and I did get it from a friend from Germany she had a lovely channel but she's not there anymore and I sent her an email but I didn't get a response so I don't know apparently she stopped with her channel uh, but it's lovely it's this little friend and it's the pink color and it has a kitten on it and a mouse and it says hello little friend so it stays in my friend team from yesterday yesterday I had put, put that lovely dress with friends on it for on my Noah there are hearts and a kitten and I think Team Thursday last week was kitten, but I'm not sure. I cannot remember that things anymore. And this is a lovely velour pair of trousers with the feet on it, and it's very small. So I think it will be will be very good for her. And then I have this matching hair bow that's really spring-like with a flower. So we will put that on our sweet little girl. And she has her lemmy with her. It's a lovely cute lemmy. Yes, she loves that. That's also for the spring. And this is a lovely spring but also autumn like sleeper because there are some some um, autumn leaves and the yeah the ahorns I think from the autumn on it but it's very lovely there is also a button with a, with a flower I really love this sleeper on her and um, I did put it on her when I needed some cuddles with her so she's so cute can you see her veining on her hand not sure if you can see it. We have to see on 
got a big screen. Oh, she is so cute. And this hand is so sweet. It's so tiny. She is really a preemie sized baby. But a bigger preemie. She reminds me of one of our grandchildren who was born one month too early. So she's a little bit that size. She has tiny, tiny legs. I will, I will show you. I will also take off her socks so I can show you her feet. Sometimes nice to see the details. I'm curious if there are more Xias in our reborn community. But it's exciting that we have Honey over at GNA's Joy and Honey is painted very different than my one. I, I did keep her very the Bailey look. I don't know if you can see the feigning on her feet. Can you see it? Yeah, I wanted to keep the feigning very, very uh, slightly. She has lovely toes. Really a lovely, lovely, lovely sculpt she is. I like her. And she has very. I hear you can also see some feigning maybe. She has very um yeah, very lovely tiny tiny uh hear some feigning tiny expressions from a early born baby. Yes. <laughs> okay, well, it is with the ring light because it's already in the afternoon here, in the late afternoon. But um, that's no problem. I did make a um, a tiny, I can show you, a tiny um, diaper for her with Anime's lovely place on it. Yes! So. It's wetness day and it's also a wild wetness day. Well, a, a lamb is not really a wild animal more. So I will put this, the sockies on again for under her trousers. And then we can see if this is the good size for her. Maybe it's big for her. Yeah, she is a tiny one. She is a tiny one. Well, the, the length of the legs are good, but it's a little bit, yeah, wide on her, but it's no problem. <laughs> Now we have to see with the sweater, with a lovely sweater. The lovely sweater. She's a tiny one, so she has a long sleeved onesie. Under her sweater to stay warm because those tiny tiny ones you have to keep them warm. Well, I hope your witness day is going very well. I also want to say hello to. Uh, Shara, because we miss her videos. I don't know. Maybe she's too busy or still grieving over her her animal, her pet, her 
a lovely doggy we can understand that of course but when you are watching Shara we want to say hello to you so and I will do her hair a little bit she has lovely curly white hair spray that a little bit or oh, there's something in her hair maybe yeah I don't like to do this on camera because it's it's then my arm is before it you know Well, I will do it. So there she is, my sweet tiny one. I did put the hair bow on her hair and put some some uh, conditioner in her hair. Lovely curly hair, beautiful, matching her skin tone, the white blonde hair. So there she is. It fits her perfectly, I think. Yes, it's lovely on her. So, the Bible verse for today. It's the 13th of March already. That says, Mercy and truth are met together. Righteousness and peace have kissed each other. Psalm 85, verse 10. Beautiful verse about mercy. Mercy and truth. And I will also read for you out of the Be Still and Know book for today. And today it was about choosing wisdom. If you wait at wisdom's doorway, looking to hear a word for every day, joy will break forth within you as you listen for what I'll say. For the fountain of life pours into your every time that you find me. And this is the secret of growing in the delight of the fa in the favor of the Lord. Proverbs 8, verse 34 till 36. The word wisdom is used hundreds of times in the Bible. Time and time again, we are instru instructed to use good judgment, to make sound decisions, to use prudence and circumspection. Circumspection. King Solomon made a special point to ask God to give him wisdom throughout his time as Israel's leader. Because of this, God honored and blessed him. But we all know that King Solomon didn't have a very good end in his life. But yeah, because of all the wives he had. But yeah. There's a small, very small prayer in this book. God, I choose wisdom today. I wait at wisdom's doorway. I know true happiness happiness is found there. So at the wisdom's doorway there's true happiness. And of course we know that we can find true happiness in Jesus Christ our Lord. I will also read out of this book for you the prayer for today Jesus listens by Sarah Young because they these prayers are very beautiful inspiring prayers based on Bible scripture and there is also one Bible scripture that struck me today when I was doing Bible study about Acts Romans 8 verse 28 tells us we know that all things work together for good for those who love God who are called according to his purpose Yes, there was a story about Paul that he did survive the shipwrecking, and then he was uh, uh, there was a, s a snake or a hose it was stinging to his hand, and then the people around him at the island Malta said, "Well, he must be a murderer because now he's going to die. This is his uh, his punishment." But um, 
you didn't get anything from from the snake so uh, from the biting the biting of the snake so then they said you will probably you are a god and then they were listening to his good news that he had so he had a, a, a shipwreck and a sting of a snake not good things not good things at all and um but out of that bad things the lord make made good things happening because the people on the island malta were helping him and the other people and they were blessed by the lord so yeah that was really an encouragement for me today that sometimes we can be in terrible circumstances and we don't understand it we cannot we don't get an explanation from the lord why things are happening but he can work out it for good when we are trusting him and we keep our eyes on him out of roman 8 verse 28 it says we know we know that all things works together for good for those who love God, who are called according to his purpose. So yeah, our, our, the only thing we have to do is love him and trust in him. And we will pray together. All knowing God, please prepare me for the day that stretches out before me. You know exactly what this day will contain. Whereas I have only fake, ide fake ideas, ideas about it. I wish I could see a map that would show all the twists and turns of today's and tomorrow's journey. I'd feel better prepared if I could somehow visualize what is on the road up ahead. But you've been teaching me a better way to prepare for whatever I will encounter today, spending quality time with you. Even though I don't know what's awaiting me on the path ahead, I trust that you have equipped me well for the journey. I'm thrilled by the promise that you are my companion each step of the way. And I'm learning to stay in better communication with you, whispering your name when I need to redirect my thoughts to you. This simple practice helps me walk through the day with my focus on you. Lord, I rejoice in your abiding presence, the best possible roadmap. In your delightful name we pray, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. What a beautiful prayer. What a beautiful thing. To, and I started this day tomorrow, this morning. I started this morning with this prayer. And now it's in the afternoon. And I thought, well, I will make a video. And then I thought, well, I will read it. Still, I will read it. Because I know some people from you are watching my videos in their morning. So you can start your day with this beautiful prayer. And um, thank you for watching my lovely, sweet Angelica. She is so cute in this this lovely outfit for on Wednesdays we wear pink well dear friends I hope you did enjoy it and um, I want to wish you a very blessed rest of this day bye for now love you big hugs bye bye